Tonight, in one of our most disturbing investigations to date, we uncover a multi-billion dollar scam wreaking havoc on the nation's youth. They called it a master's in fine arts. Business school. Physics and philosophy. All names for the same multi-billion dollar racket. Graduate school. Meet Mark Neumeyer. He fell for a scam called law school. I invested $150,000. I did everything they said to do. And when I finished, I still couldn't get a job. What did they tell you? They blamed the economy. Erica Jones told us about a complicated hierarchy. After I got my master's, I thought I was done. Mm -hmm. But then they told me if I really wanted to get ahead, I needed to get my PhD. So you needed to pay for more levels? Yes. You know what it's like? Scientology. They gave Erica a 200 square foot room where she was forced to serve as a residential advisor to sexually rampant alcoholics. I was in the final stage. My dissertation, it was too late to turn back. She's talking about the impossibly long papers professors assign on useless topics intended to make students drop out after their financial obligations have been met. The paper trail took us here, the bursar's office, a fancy name for the drop house. After the money's collected, it's rerouted to fund athletic programs, unnecessary libraries for religious departments, and the list goes on. You'd think they'd ride off in the sunset with what they got, but instead, I get a call a year later from something called the uh, alumni department, and they're asking me for a donation. And then they won't stop sending me these propaganda pamphlets. And if it can happen to me, you know, it can happen to anybody. 